Hi, today we're at Ray Chrysler. My name is Colin Morgan. I am senior tech here in the shop. Today we're, we're actually working on a 3.6 Atkins hybrid. Um, but for the Jeep guys, I wanted to show you about the oil cooler failures um, that are happening on the Jeeps and where they're entailed. Uh, this is an oil cooler filter assembly and you see that it's a phenolic plastic with an aluminum cooler that coolant runs through mounted to an aluminum block. As heat expands and contracts uh, the parts in here, uh, these seals get flat and since there's oil pressure running through here and coolant, it will cause the oil to leak out the back and then down on the transmissions on the Jeeps, this is where they lie. Here's with the intake, lower intake off. Same motor, Atkins, this is the lower intake. They're hiding under here. So you have to take everything off the top of the motor, pull the injector rail and lower intake to gain access, drain the coolant, uh, change the oil to replace these things. Uh, a lot of failures also, where the oil filter goes into the housing, there's an O-ring here. People forget to change those. And if they crank it down really tight, it spreads the housing and it'll put a hairline crack in it. You'll never see it. Hence, it'll start pumping all the oil out of the vehicle and out, usually out the back after it fills up the valley, out the back down the trans, you know, bell housing down the trans. And that's it. Um, if you have any of these problems, you know, bring it on in to Ray here and we'll take care of it.